Welcome to the Elite Eight, where we wind down this tournament. In this video, we're going to find out who DHI is going against from the Fragrance Bros bracket. Keep it tuned in. Fragrance Tournament continues. The clock starts now. Fragrance family, what's going on? Welcome to Mark Madness Elite 8. Let's take a look at the contestants. Today, my number four rated of my top 100 list, The Autumn Intense, is looking for a dancing partner in this video. We're going to see who DHI is going against today in the Elite 8. The contestants were Gucci Purim 2 versus Tal Daramez. And with a score of 70 to 47, we're going to take the trash bin out. We're going to have to say goodbye to Gucci Purim 2. So the tea-based fragrance is gone. Congratulations to Tel Darmez or the Toilette. Guess what? You're dancing right now. Uh, we're going to take a look at this matchup right now. So that sets our Elite 8 bracket as the winner of Brooklyn Fragrance Lovers. So who's repping break the Brooklyn Fragrance Lovers bracket is... The Autumn Intense, my number four rated, goes against Fragrance Bros winner, which is, of course, uh, Tal Darmezzo de Toilette, which was my number 21 rated, my top 100 list. Now, the winner of this bracket moves on to the final four. So this is, of course, Fragrance Bros versus Brooklyn Fragrance Lovers bracket. So we're going to see who is moving on. The rules are the same, 24 hours um, as per the rule book. So... Once this is uploaded on YouTube, you got 24 hours to vote on one of these fragrances that is going to move on to the final four. So again, vote, uh, don't vote often, but vote early. <laughs> um, so we'll see who moves on. Uh, Christian Ziad, of course, has a lot of fragrances in uh, this Elite Eight. You're going to see a lot of them, but uh, Tel Darmezzo de Toilette is a uh, stunning fragrance. So I can't wait to see who is going to move on in this one. Thank you so much for the support. If you haven't already, Please hit that like button. I certainly appreciate it for my efforts. Thanks for watching. Have a good one.